National Park Service logo, text reading Mount Rushmore National Memorial, Experience Your America, text reading A Place to Heal, an interview with Gerard Baker. Video of an interview with Gerard Baker, the former superintendent at Mount Rushmore National Memorial. Gerard is an American Indian man. He is standing outside on a bright sunny day. Mount Rushmore has many meanings to me. First of all, it means... Image of the heads of Mount Rushmore. We do honor these four presidents who shaped our country. Video footage of the interview with Gerard Baker. They shaped it in, in the way of making us free for today. They shaped it for the future, but at the same time, Mount Rushmore is a place of a lot of sadness. Sadness in the fact that this was Indian land at one time. It was a place where the Indians lived. It was a place where the Indians had to come and do everything from their ceremonies to hunting to gathering to supporting their families. Image of Mount Rushmore before the carving, transitioning back to the interview footage. Mount Rushmore is a bittersweet phenomenon, I'll put it that way, for many American Indian people. Even though, yes, we have a free country to live in, we are still have to depend on the government for our survival in many cases. Even though yet we are taking steps forward to, to do our own uh, programs and to live life the way we should. Image of the faces of Mount Rushmore. As we look at these four presidents, and the four presidents, again, mean many things. Each one of them did something marvelous for this country. Each one of them had a vision that is still unbelievable today. Back to video footage of interview with Gerard Baker. But at the same time, we have to understand that each one of them had a very bad Indian policy of removal. Portrait of an American Indian chief. Photo of non-Indian people visiting a village. There's a teepee and several American Indians sitting and standing around of putting them in reservations. There's always a negative side to that as well. Transition back to video footage of Gerard. The change has occurred where Mount Rushmore means that it's available for everybody and then now we have an opportunity to tell the stories from all angles and from all sides. A series of photos depicting many American Indians visiting Mount Rushmore National Memorial. Visiting with tourists, wearing military garb, performing traditional hoop dances, and even beating a drum. The American Indians can come in here and tell their story, and Mount Rushmore now means totally that it is for everybody. Images of a naturalization ceremony showing people from all over the world becoming U.S. citizens. We see more and more American Indians coming to visit Mount Rushmore. Footage of interview with Gerard Baker. And, and some of them obviously still have bitter stories, but through that bitterness, there is hope for the future. And we're seeing that now through academics, through cultural uh, renaissance, if you will, with the American Indian population, especially the young, and a place where they can come here and, and, and feel, yes, this, is, this was their home and still is their home. Photo of a family with twin sons. One son is reaching up and shaking the hand of an American Indian man dressed in traditional garb. Photo of a teepee on grounds at Mount Rushmore. Video footage of interview with Gerard Baker. Being the first American Indian to be the superintendent here when I came in six years ago was really scary. Uh, the first thing I did was to talk to many different Indian people from many different tribes that I had established contact with in my past, uh, in my past experiences with the Park Service. And talking with them and really asking them, should I do this? Should I come in here and should I be this first Indian superintendent in what was typically in a, a non-Indian park? Um, what I expected them to say was, don't do it. What I found was something absolutely different. What I found, especially from the elders, was they told me, by all means do this. By all means come in here and establish an American Indian presence. Video footage of Daryl Redcloud, an interpretive park ranger at Mount Rushmore, playing a traditional drum. Transition back to the interview with Gerard. One of the grandmothers I talked to from the, from the Ogallala tribe, actually, she said, what a place to heal. Close-up photo of Teddy Roosevelt on Mount Rushmore. Transitions to video of Gerard Baker. We need to make this place, this place being the world, this place being Mother Earth or Grandmother Earth, so that it doesn't change for the future generations. And again, that's what the National Park Service is about as well. 
aerial photograph of the Black Hills featuring spires of granite rock. It's a very sacred place here. National Park Service logo, text reading, Mount Rushmore National Memorial, experience your America.